This is the fly for today and it is a zebra midge, which is a great fly all by itself. But if you're in a pressured area where they see a lot of zebra midges, we've made a little addition. So I got a little bit of uh, fuzz off of Zelon and it's two-toned. If you look at the natural midges, they have that little clump of leggy looking stuff on the tail end of it. So we've added that and maybe this will make it a better pattern and pressured water. So here's how we tie it. Okay, so we got a number 18 jig hook. And we're just going to get the thread started. Make pretty nice tight wraps all the way to the back. And we'll get that bead in place at the end. So we'll just trim that. So the enhancement piece, a little tough to zeal on. I'm going to take just maybe three or four fibers of that. Just get that little clump. And I only want about an eighth of an inch or maybe a little more. Get that down with the pinch method. A wrap or two and I'm gonna take that and trim it so it's just behind the bead like that now I'm gonna get my silver wire in I'm gonna do the same thing I'll run that up to just behind the bead so we'll get that on And then we're just going to make a tight body with the black thread. That's going to be the body. Make sure I get all those little fibers down. straight we got a trim here and I want to give the body a little taper so I'm gonna come back about to there come forward and come back for about a third of it and I'm gonna come forward bring the wire in so get our wire rib on wraps. I'm just going to twirl that till it snaps. And I'm going to build up a little collar of the black thread. Keep the bead in place. finish. Trim that. I'm going to 
take the fly and just kind of tilt it down just a hair. And we're going to take some UV cure. Just a little drop, not a lot. Okay, we'll hit that with the light. And I'm just gonna make just a little, make these just a hair shorter. And I'm gonna take a black Sharpie and just Mark the ends of that. And that's it. Kind of an enhanced zebra midge for pressured fish. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe to the channel and help us keep growing. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, I get back to everyone, so please send them in. And as always, thanks for watching the video.